Thanks to SSMS, or Small Spacecraft Mission Service, more than 50 satellites will be launched at once. This new dispenser has been developed by ESA and Avio and manufactured by Saab Aerospace in the Czech Republic. The European Commission is contributing to this proof-of-concept flight. Until now, the launch opportunities for the smallest class of satellites were limited as they typically had to make use of large satellite launches' spare capacity to get a piggyback ride to orbit. But the SSMS takes a different approach. The uh, Small Spacecraft Mission Service allows to perform dedicated launches specific for and tailored for uh, small spacecrafts. In this way, this on one side there is uh, the reduction of the launch cost and on the other side there is a maximization of the launch opportunities. The SSMS is composed of modular parts, such as a hexagon module, rods, towers and columns. These can be assembled in various configurations, depending on the requirements of the satellites that will be launched, offering a great versatility and the ability to accommodate any combination of customers. The payload integration for the lower part of the system is done in Europe by the SSMS manufacturer, reducing cost and effort for small satellite companies. The top-level satellites are added at Europe's spaceport in Kourou. Once in orbit, the satellites will be deployed in a coordinated fashion, after which the Vega upper stage carrying SSMS will de-orbit. Later on, this new dispenser will also be used for Vega C, offering an extra 800 kilograms of capacity and an enlarged volume within a wider launcher fairing, at the same cost as Vega today, flying even more passengers per individual SSMS launch with a significant cost reduction per kilo. An important development for Europe in an evolving launcher market. Today we are trying to uh, cover all the market needs that we have um, concerning launching uh, uh, satellites into low Earth orbit. This SSMS um, service is uh, uh, today compatible both with the Vega as well as with the upgraded version of Vega called Vega C. In reality, we are today uh, uh, designing a generalized version of the SSMS for Vega C so that we will be able to launch any kind of combination of small uh, uh, spacecrafts in the future and we are using uh, the opportunity that we have with the Vega to have a proof of this concept. For this maiden flight, SSMS will deliver all its passengers into the same sun synchronous orbit at an altitude of 550 kilometers. But in the future, Vega could deliver its payloads on separate orbits with SSMS Europe is making its lightweight Vega launcher more versatile, thus providing new launch opportunities for small satellite manufacturers and operators at competitive costs.